In lecture 10, we will cover section 4.3. At the end of today's lecture, you should be able to apply node voltage analysis to circuits with independent current and voltage sources. To begin, we have to recognize that by adding an independent voltage source, we are removing a degree of freedom from our system of equations. That is, we need one less equation to describe the behavior of our circuit. For we are prescribing the voltage at our node. Thus the number of KCL equations needed when we have a independent voltage source is as follows. Our number of KCL equations is equal to our number of nodes, less the number of voltage sources we have, less unity. Furthermore, we are going to talk about the concept of a supernode, where we have two nodes connected by a voltage source.